The Harida Moria combo is constructed of a layer of foam filled cells on top of a foam underside support with foam surround. It's a 1 in 2 11 and a half minute cycle system. The rapid cell deflation is unique in the sense that pressure relief happens much quicker than on a standard dynamic mattress system. Cell construction consists of 9 cells filled with deluxe foam. The cells alternate in an 11 and a half minute cycle. What this means is that the one set of alternate cells deflate for 5 minutes then start to inflate again to equalise with the other set of alternate cells for a minute and a half before the second set then deflate for 5 minutes completing the 11 and a half minute cycle. The Harida Mori combo operates with a digital pump. Switch the pump on at the power socket and press the power button on the control panel. The pump will automatically inflate to 80 kilograms, which offers 22 millimetres of mercury in pressure into the cells. To set the pump to operate with the patient's weight, we need to first unlock the pump. To do this, hold down the lock unlock button for three seconds. The pump will sound a sharp beep and the blue LED light will go off once the pump is unlocked. If the patient's weight is greater than 80 kilograms, you may need to increase the pressure by pressing the firm button. Pressing this button once will increase the pressure in increments of 5 kilograms. To reduce the pressure, press the soft button. Again, this will reduce in increments of 5 kilograms. The pump is designed to offer ultra low pressure delivery for lightweight, frail individuals, including paediatric patients. Pressing the static button on the pump's control panel will stop the alternation cycle and both sets of cells will remain fully inflated. When the static button is actioned, you will see the top LED light and the pressure monitor light illuminated. Static mode allows clinical procedures, site transfers or any other procedure to occur. Simply press the static mode button again once the panel is unlocked to switch off the static mode. If the static mode has been selected, as a safety function, the system will revert back to the alternating cycle after 25 minutes. Upon installation, it's important to ensure that the securing straps are attached to the moving parts of the bed frame. For example, the knee brake and the backrest. Never secure the straps to the outer edges of the bed frame, as this will damage the mattress and the bed. The patient recurrently using the Harida Moray combo is in the supine position. You can also see that every other cell is deflated. As I place my hand between the body and deflated cells, we can feel and see that there is sufficient clearance, providing the patient with relief. The rapid cell deflation system is unique as pressure relief happens much quicker than on a standard dynamic system, offering immediate relief. The Harida Moray combo has a foam insert on the underside of the cells as well as the heel area, which prevents any bottoming onto the bed frame. The foam consists of combustion modified ether or CME technology. The Harida Moray combo has a unique CPR function where there is no requirement to frantically search for the CPR function in an emergency. Simply detach the mattress from the pump and commence CPR. Due to the nature of the foam filled cells under low pressure, CPR can also be administered while inflated. To convert the static mattress to a dynamic system, Remove the tube set connector from the foot of the mattress and connect to the pump. The Harida Moray combo comes with a troubleshooting guide on the front panel of the pump, indicating what to do in the event of any problems, whether that be a power cut or an alarm function or inappropriate cell operation. If the system has a power cut or power is removed from the system, an alarm will sound to indicate that there is a problem. If the pump has a kettle lead, it could simply be that the cable has become detached. In all cases, the first check should be that the power is connected and is also switched on. If the system is depressed as low as 6 mm of mercury for a period of 6 minutes, the alarm will sound. If during the course of all troubleshooting effects you still can't identify the problem, it is important to ensure the tubing on the cells is not kinked. The tubing is located on the side of the mattress where it delivers air to the cells. The tubes will be secured to the mattress by a small cable tie to ensure that they do not detach. 
Regular cleaning of the mattress is required and we provide cleaning instructions in the user manuals. Copies can also be supplied on request. Maintenance and repair work should only be carried out by an appointed engineer who has been trained by Harida Healthcare. Only original manufacturer parts should be used in any repairs as failure could affect the warranty. In all instances, with any pressure relieving products, always ensure that you seek clinical guidance and use the product in accordance with manufacturer instructions. Thanks for watching. For further information, please feel free to contact ourselves directly.